a pleasant good day, Royals fans. This is going to be the recap of yesterday's game. I'm going to be doing my preview to today's game later. Of course, there's our first place Reading Royals. They just wanted them to get comfortable, right? They put them up 2-0 and then slammed the door shut. And they put them up 2-0, obviously. I'm joking. But, um, obviously, uh, Robbie Payne was able to score a goal. Um, and then they had one <clears throat> that was from the point, And then they had one from Patrick Grasso. That was a weird play, it got and then passed to him in front as the puck was like kind of it looked like the players were looking to see where it went after it took a bounce. And um they got that second goal, but then it was all Reading Royals as Trevor Gooch uh potted one on a very nice uh cross ice pass. He got his fifth already from Garrett McFadden and Jackson Cressy. Cressy uh, was a player of the game as far as I'm concerned in this game because he had a killer fight that he won plus an assist on that goal. I don't even care that he didn't have the factors in the scoring of the other play. He played well in overall, and you have that great fight, and you were able to get an assist. That makes you a player of the game in my book. I love players that are able to set the tempo or keep the momentum going in your favor like that via the fight that's not used enough in today's game overall. Now, in the ECHL, I think it is used more than it is at other levels, but overall in hockey, I think you guys know what I'm talking about. Then we have Anthony Gagnon, who since coming here has been very good. That is his eighth goal on the season. Patrick Bykoff and Patrick McNally, double patch, uh, got the assist for that one. Dominic Cormier then came in. He's so good as a defenseman, already his sixth goal, at coming in and getting the shot, creating a shot, creating a lane at the point. I love the way he's able to play an offensive style game as a defenseman, but still be the word to the wiser as well as a defenseman and not kind of get caught and all that type of stuff as well. Then Trevor Gooch as well, scoring, got the lone assist on the Patty Bykoff goal um, that Bykoff was able to wire home uh, there. And then we have Patrick McNally, who of course had two assists earlier, so he's of course a player of the game, two assists and potting a goal. Uh, Patrick McNally was able to get one assisted by Morrison and Ebbing when Morrison made a very nice move to be able to get the puck across to McNally, and voila, uh, then uh, they were able to score. Karo Ustamenko, Usti Ustamenko, um, looked very solid in this game, making a 35 of 37. Uh, he got 35 saves, of course, on 37 shots. Uh, looked sharp yet again. Now it seems like he's starting to kind of get his groove back and be what we saw in the 1920 season. Dylan's talked about it on the broadcast. And also, um, on this video, I wonder what doing all the best in his next endeavors is, of course, he announced at the beginning of February he's going to be moving on. But, um... When it comes to Karo Ustamenko, it, it it takes time to come off of the hip surgery and everything. And it, and we did want to see him get back to the 1920 form. It looks like that's starting to slowly but surely happen. And that's beautiful and that's even better to see since they've already been getting good goaltending when it's come to Pat Nagel being down this year, Kote Kazanavi from Hayden Hawkey. So now you have Kirill being Kirill to throw Ustamenko again. That's going to be huge for this team. But that about wraps up our recap of the great win. They were just trying to let them get comfortable, get confident, let them go up two to zip, and then pounced and shut the door on the Anirondack Thunder as Trevor Gooch was able to get a goal, who then later had an assist. He is a player of the game. Patrick McNally, they will have two assists and a goal. He is a player of the game. And for me, uh, you have to give it also Garrett Cockrell and Trevor Gooch, returning players that played for the Royals before, making huge contributions in their first handful of games playing for the organization again. So that's great to see Anthony Gagnon coming in, playing fantastic. That's also great to see. So the additions are playing great. That's always helpful as well as I close out this video. But those would be the stars of the game, McNally, Cressy, and Trevor Gooch. So everybody have a great, safe, and pleasant day. Please stay safe out there. Enjoy the game today. I'll be doing a preview for that later. Continue to subscribe down below or up above in the easy-to-use widget to help us grow to the 200th goal, the 200th subscribers by the end of February. Peace out, everybody, and go Reading Royals.